Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I am of the stars. And I thought I'd mention something that I just found out about. There's been a lot of talk on the astral stories lately about a very evil uh, like group or entity uh, that's called, unfortunately called on the internet, it's called the Secret Service are sometimes specified by a particular agency. And, um, and this, this is kind of a hell world scenario where, where these, this secret service or these <clears throat> secret agents, you know, like on TV, um, they embody demonic qualities like, um, killing for personal reasons or, you know, raping women, killing children, things like that. Things that, that our Secret Service, our true government and our true Secret Service consider to be crimes, you know. And uh, so, so what it is, what these astral stories are about, is an attempt by the demon world to instill fear in us of our own government agencies that are sworn to protect us as, as citizens. So, this is not true. This is what you might call the... Do you know how I've, I've spoken before about uh, the black magic mass, or the black mass for short? and reversals and so forth that black magickers use to change things that are inherently good into something that's bad. And so I could, this is a new term I guess, but I could term this the Black Magic Secret Service or the Black Secret Service for short. This is a, a very um, loaded term right now and apparently it's being used on the astral realm negative by astral beings negative uh, to, to cause more chaos in, in world government. And so the difficulty is that, and, and the wonderful thing is, that for the first time in the United States history, we have elected a person of color to the presidency, which is which is really says a lot for us as a people that we finally um, uh, broken down that wall of prejudice against people who, who are a very important part of the American culture, you know. And, and because this is a new thing and a wonderful new change for us, um, it, it raises some, like, opposing feelings from people who aren't willing to change. And so the sentiment of these people to, to speak badly of our president uh, is embodied in this, in this notion that of, of, calling him, of calling him black, when in fact these days we speak of people of color in very different ways. For instance, we might use the term African American, or in, in other contexts, Asian American, or uh, Latin American. We always use the word American because our, all our citizens, no matter what culture, no matter what race, are American and help to create the rich tapestry of diversity that is this country. We're one of the most diverse countries in the world and that is one of our great strengths. Now, now to get back to this issue of the term Black Secret Service, um, it's possible that in the astral realm negative, it's being used pejoratively to refer to our current president, who is a very heroic figure in American history. History will speak of this. And I, and I would like to expose that right now as simply a ploy of, of a world of hatred 
and and lack of free will and lack of consideration for the welfare of the world and lack of consideration for what's known in the old days as the common good to now to get on with this. I want you to know very firmly where I stand with regard to this. Now to get on with this topic of the quote unquote black magic secret service. It's, a, it's just a black magic um, ploy to make us fearful of something that's good. It, there's no truth in it. So, God bless you all.